Isaac Welly has muscular atrophy. It took away his ability to walk about a year ago. His current electric wheelchair is much too small for him. His parents had been battling with Medicaid to get a new one. After months of waiting, they needed help ripping through the red tape. Less than a day after their story aired back in July, Medicaid finally approved the chair. Last few months have been like waiting for Christmas. Isaac's been asking us when he's getting the wheelchair. Christmas morning finally came. Isaac's chair was delivered to the excited teen <laughs> and his equally excited family. What happens if you press these buttons? Don't, Don't press those buttons. It took a little getting used to. Ready? But after some adjustments, Isaac was riding in style. Well, it means the world to all of us, I guess you could say. But yeah, he's. A, I can definitely see a difference. He's a lot happier that he's got this chair now. A lot happier because this isn't just a chair. It allows Isaac to move himself into a standing position as well, something he desperately needs to keep what muscle and joint movement that he has left. It also allows the team to be more independent. What do you like about it? It stands up. Isaac's a man of few words, but one thing is clear. It's going to be cool. When you think about all you had to go through to get this chair for him, what goes through your mind? So worth it. Very worth it to see him be able to stand again with his peers. He's going to just be able to do so much more on his own. It's all been a long time coming, but in the end, taking those scissors to the red tape was just what this family needed. You are your kid's voice. Don't stop. Don't ever, ever stop. Keep going. Don't let them tell you no. In Saratoga County, Jennifer Lukey, CBS 6 News.